experience is good if you if you take from it and learn from it. Um, I think just with how we set up everything, it just it was just a little uh, quicker and easier, you know, from what we did last year when how we wanted the structure of this thing. Um, and that's not just me, you know, that's everybody in that building. So we take input from everybody and, you know, there's a, a board kind of of thoughts and ideas and likes and dislikes and that's communication is open. And um, we talk about all those things, but ultimately uh, what we decided, I like where we're at. But a lot of, I mean, I we <laughs> say grinded them out this off season. Um, they did a lot of work this off season, which is what you have to do as a coach in the National Football League in any league. Um, but I, I told them uh, Friday, you know, now is our time to make the players feel that improvement from us. So they need to feel that improvement, you know, and it could be how you have something written on a PowerPoint slide. Like that's better this year than it was last year. Here's why, you know. So I'm excited for those guys to take what they learned from, you know, all the way back to a year ago, but throughout the season and then really this off season, what I wanted focused on and studied and guys did their own thing. And then we had structure for certain things of improvement, you know, take it and run with it and make sure the players feel that, you know, and uh, so they're excited about this, this off season. Um, we got a bunch of guys that are team first guys in there that are competitive and want to improve their games. That's what the culture is. And, um, I think, you know, you have to work on that daily because your actions go into culture on a daily basis. So uh, we all got to be aligned and we got to be on it. And when we get out of alignment, that's OK. You got to get back in alignment quick. So that's what wins. And uh, our guys understand that. And uh, I'm happy where it's at day one. I think, yeah, how we have it laid out, you know, going into year two, what this off season looked like, what now with the players back in the building, what that looks like for these eight weeks, you know, at times ticking eight weeks. I keep saying that it's not a lot of time. You know what I mean? We got to do a lot and improve a lot before we go on break to get to training camp and going into year two. But uh, uh, yeah, it's kind of how I always envisioned that that's what we're doing. Um, there's a lot of common ground and knowledge now that we didn't have last year, you know, because you're, we're meeting guys for the first time. You're implementing things for the first time. Um, in that room, we made some adjustments in that room, too, as far as how we're doing things. So that'll be part of the, hey, this is carryover. This is tweaked. This is new. But, um, yeah, the guys feel real comfortable with how those guys operate in there as a unit, uh, individually and collectively. And uh, I'm really excited about some of the changes, I think, for development of the players and health of the players. I think we took a step forward. So proof will be in the pudding. But uh, excited about day one. I mean, you know, I think they know that um, how we want to operate on a daily basis with our process. And then in turn, you know, they did it last year, but they take it over. You know what I mean? So the new guys, I don't have to tell Mac what's expected. Kaiser tells him. And um, that's a cool thing because then you see kind of the connection with the players go on and they, they kind of take the team over. So we'll lay out the blueprint for them, show them the good and the bad, and keep them aligned. But ultimately, the team's going to take it over. But if you want to know something, ask the players. So I, you guys know I value their opinion, um, what they need, what they want to, you know, they think in their mind that can help everybody. Um, we try to, I try to listen to all that and uh, implement a lot of those things, but a lot of player input. There's a bunch of them. Um, I told the players in there today, you know, you've heard me talk about uh, in my mind what it takes to be a good pro. There's kind of five buckets that we use. And, you know, on a daily basis, we have to improve those buckets. And um, anyone that's in that building is there to serve the players. And we worked on our game, you know. So I told them there's going to be some things that are same as. I told them there's going to be some things that are slightly tweaked and there's going to be some brand new, brand new things. So um, hopefully the growth that we had throughout the year and then this off season, uh, the players feel that and they understand the why behind it and they can improve. Yeah, I mean, I was just in a quarterback meeting with him. Uh, the questions he's asking are really good questions, Drew, and is better be on it. But uh, yeah, I think him being healthy, one, is a huge, you know, step forward. Um, he feels really good where he's at right now. And then just taking ownership and command and in, going into year two, 
and really keep being who he is. You know what I mean? And, and, uh, I think that he'll continue to do that, but definitely with him being healthy year two in a system, um, he's excited. So are we.